Hello, good. 9.30 a.m. at the CWA. Oh, I'm about to nap in a minute. All right, so we got the Page of Pentacles in reverse. We got some unexpected news coming. <coughs> but you feel it coming up. It's almost like I know, I know this about to happen. I just don't know. The lovers. Or somebody's reaching out to you. You're ignoring the fuck out that shit. Emperor. Two of Wands in reverse. Ace of Swords. Somebody's about to be left alone. Whoever this King of Pentacles is. This could be what they're requesting, like, leave me alone. But. I feel like somebody's about to be left completely the fuck alone. Like, by themselves. Like, and they gonna feel a way about that shit. Somebody doesn't plan on, um, somebody, somebody doesn't plan on you leaving or some shit like that. Two of Cups. You're walking away from a connection or something like that. Somebody is... Sh <clears throat> I don't know, man. I just feel like... Somebody has some type of feelings for you or some shit like that, but you don't feel the same way about this person. Like, somebody's not planning on you leaving. Yeah, the Ten of Wands, the Strength, and the Three of Swords, like... It's supposed to be like you you supposed to develop such strong feelings or something like that and you don't want to go nowhere. It's something like that. That's not the case here. Exactly. The King of Cups, the Moon, and the Chariot. <clears throat> it's almost as though Somebody been trying you from the jump. The high priestess and the, the hermit. These are opposite energies. <clears throat> Pisces and Virgo, they're opposite signs. You and somebody else are seeing connection totally fucking different. It's like it's like oil and water. The Two of Cups, the Nine of Wands, the Strength. <clears throat> somebody is offering you something or somebody did offer you something based off of how you look or off of how hot they get in their fucking pants when they see you. I don't know how else to explain this. This, this Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, the King of Swords, and the High Priest. Somebody is doing something to try to keep you around, so they're not expecting you for you to fucking leave. Or they're not 
they're not expecting, like, they have no intentions on you leaving or some shit like that. Ten of Pentacles. Because you know what I'm getting? When Steve Harvey, uh, he did a stand-up. <clears throat> he was talking about... <clears throat> He was talking about the difference between um, firing black people and firing white people. Like, when you fire white people, they never see it coming. When you fire black people, like, it's about to be some shit that goes down. So, I feel like this could have something to do with your job or some shit like that. I'm not sure, like, um, but I feel like the reason, first of, first of all, for some of y'all, I feel like the reason that you got the job or you're going to get the job is because somebody, they, they're extremely sexually and just physically attracted to you. If this is not about a job, this is about a contract or like some other shit, it could be a house, it could be a car, it could be whatever the fuck. I feel like the reason that somebody decides to go into partnership with you is because they actually like you, and they, they, it's like in their mind, because I'm hearing the nice guy always finishes last, but you have no intention on sleeping with this person, and you're not, I don't, I, I don't feel like you're attracted to this person, though, <laughs> like, this is so one fucking sided here, somebody's using their authoritative role, to like get you to like them like yeah I got this I got that or I can give you this or whatever the fuck like then you gonna like me like like a barter system I do this for you and then you you, you want to be with me because I just helped you it's some shit like that like I don't know what the fuck going on here they're not expecting um yeah they're not expecting you to move on though they're not expecting you to move on at all house, car, job, relationship, something like that, I don't know, but somebody's being the nice guy or the nice girl because they have another motive. Yeah, page of pentacles in the chariot. With the death. I'm getting permanent though. Like somebody thought something was gonna be permanent and it's not. Yeah, the death, the star, the world, hey man, five of pentacles, king of swords, and boom, king of cups. You're literally moving on from something that somebody else is heavily in their fucking feelings about it. Yeah, this is some weird ass shit. The Ace of Swords, the Queen of Wands, the Seven of Swords, the Sun, Ten of Cups, the Fool, and the Two of Pentacles. They think I'm dumb. They don't know I see the plot. Fuck it, I see it now. Like, literally, they think I'm dumb. They don't know I see the plot. Fuck it, I see it now. Somebody's trying to trick you, fool you, into being with them. But they think you dumb. They don't know you see the plot. But fuck it, you see it now. Like the fuck? This Seven of Swords, like two cards to indicate that you know exactly what the fuck. This fuck shit is exposed. And you know about it. Whether you be a female or a male, you know about it. You know about it. Seven of Cups in the Sun. They think you stupid. They don't know you see the plot. It smells so good. This perfume, my boy, I'm just so in love with it. Queen of Pentacles, Five of Cups, Page of Swords. 
you was just kind of like supposed to not see something for what it is, but you do. I feel like your intuition tells you something off top about this person. Or about the situation, however you want to put it. Yeah, intelligence. <clears throat> Queen of Swords and the Magician. Intelligence. I feel like you read between the lines. Somebody's a cornball. Like, this some corny ass shit, bro. This is corny as fuck. You're playing the role of the fool who thinks they're fooling you. <laughs> You're playing the role, yeah, the star. You're playing the role of the fool to the fool who thinks they're fooling. They really think you dumb as fuck. I'm not even gonna lie. Not dumb, like, in the sense that you just don't got no brain, but dumb to where you're not supposed to see what the fuck's either been going on or what's going on. Justice in the Six of Swords. I feel like maybe at first you're not hip to it, but then it's like, Something draws your attention to it, or you start breaking something down, you start processing information. Because you're getting away, not with something, but divine intervention is here. Like, you're not getting away with something, you're getting away from something, though. Like, oh, we made an executive decision to get the fuck up out of there. Yeah. <clears throat> the Ace of Swords, the Three of Wands, Three of Pentacles, Two of Swords, Eight of Cups. The only reason that you're you you you're getting an opportunity or you got an opportunity is because somebody else thought that this shit was gonna be another way. Like, oh, I'm about to help this person, and this person gonna fucking like me, and then we gonna be happily ever after. And somebody with delusional mind, that's what the fuck they do. Like, like, you ain't gonna never wanna leave me. And you walking straight the fuck away. Like, like we don't see this shit the same, my nigga. I'm, I'm straight. I'm out. You got another opportunity that's coming, and you're advancing forward. Yeah, the world is over. Five of Pentacles. Yeah, nine of swords, nine of wands, four of swords, five of uh five of wands. <clears throat> By you leaving something, you're gonna fuck up something for them. That's karmic justice. I don't know what the fuck this is, but by you leaving something, it could be a home. The Tower, the Six of Pentacles, you're leaving something, it's going to fuck something up for them. That's truly why this is unexpected. It's almost like prolonging something. As long as I can get something to wait or to postpone something, uh, it, it's going to go on my way. And then that's why they're not expecting this. This is a Tower moment. Completely about to slap this person. Yep. Eight of Swords, Page of Wands. Whatever he's doing or whatever he did, he's about to be real regretful about it. Because you're gone. Yeah, Ten of Cups, High Priestess. <clears throat> Will of Fortune, Knight of Pentacles, the higher font. It's either a new contract, a new job, or a new relationship that you're st or a new partnership you're stepping into. Somebody here just gonna get left behind. Like no man left behind. This man's just getting left behind. Or this woman is getting left behind. Yep. Ten press in reverse, ten of wands in reverse. Something is too uncomfortable, too hard, it's too much work, it's too much something. Like, somebody is not doing something that they're supposed to be doing. 
they're doing that to keep you stuck or some shit like that, but they don't see that this isn't about to change. This power boom is about to, yeah, somebody's doing something on purpose. They're postponing something. And I don't know what the fuck. Like, this tempers are reverse is fucking out of control. Yeah, this shit, this plan is going completely downhill. Something's not going to keep going the way it is. Yep, you're taking your investment elsewhere. You're no longer investing in whatever the fuck this is. Somebody's going to try to figure out, like, why or... But it, it just feels like somebody was doing something on purpose. Like, this, like a landlord being like, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do this. And you still paying rent, and then they never do it. Fuck it, I'm about to just leave. And if you take this to court, you lose it anyway. Yeah, it's something about it's something about whatever the fuck this seven of swords is. They thought they was getting away with it. Nah, you taking your investment, and they're about to be fucked up. But divine intervention is in this, because karma is about to slap this person. Yeah, the moon. Somebody's doing some stupid weirdo shit on purpose, and they think you dumb. You don't see the plot. Still. I'll be right back.